hope everybody is enjoying the day today. I know I am. I believe we're reaching close to 65 degrees in Nebraska. It's the middle, well, almost the middle of December. That's crazy. So, I told my boss that I was gonna switch some hours around. <laughs> and I took the afternoon off and I'm bringing you guys all with me. I'm happy to say I filled up my bike by myself, did not spill, and it took no time at all. I think Stevie would be proud if he was with me. So I don't know if you guys have noticed yet, but look, look what I am riding with. I am riding with my new windshield for the first time. And guys, what was I thinking? I know I haven't really ridden in the cold weather with it. Um, I will say that I will not be riding with a windshield all the time, especially when it's hot out. I can only imagine what it's like riding a bike with a fairing. That would block a heck of a lot more wind. I think in the future, Stevie, we should get a fourth bike. <laughs> Just saying. I do like the windshield. I don't really know where to look. Do I look above it or through it? I'm not quite sure. The way I sit on my bike, if my back is straight, um, my eyes cut right into the top of it. So that means I might need to do a little adjustments. Hi. <laughs> How are you? Not too bad. How about you? Good. Trying to enjoy the weather. Right. <laughs> you on. All right. Thank you. Have a good one. You too. <laughs> wishing that we lived in somewhere where it was always warm. myself for the first time it's getting real I wasn't even thinking about it I was just thinking of the direction I'm headed and this is the road I took <laughs> beautiful day I love it you know I'm a little bit cold just on my legs but really other than that I mean there's a light wind today I think yesterday when I asked Alexa what today's wind was going to be like I think she said like six miles per hour or something like that so it's really not blowing at all yesterday was a little bit more wind but I had a meeting in the afternoon so I could not just leave then so so today was the day and the time on a bike just goes so fast for me anyway because I enjoy it so much I'm sure for everybody else too I mean it's got to be that way right it's just so relaxing there's just something about being in the open like this I mean a lot of people tell me I'm crazy because or we're crazy because we ride because it's so dangerous but gosh if you didn't do anything that was dangerous you wouldn't be living I mean Driving a car is dangerous too. I mean, it is. 
flying an airplane is dangerous also, but everybody does it, or most people do. Some people don't, and that's okay. But this is what we like to do for fun. road but it's somewhere that leads to somewhere else <laughs> you know I might this might sound really off the wall riding a motorcycle takes takes time to build on your confidence like let's just be real a ton especially for me so stopping at the bank a little bit ago normally would never do that I would instead wait until after hours or go to the ATM just so no one saw me. No one looked at me. No one made me feel nervous. I have no idea what I was talking about. Oh, about confidence. So it took me a long time before I would actually take my bike out either the fury or this one by myself i don't think that i got to that point of confidence level until i got my harley it has nothing to do with the difference between the fury and the harley don't think that it was just my confidence level i just wasn't quite there yet that's a pretty car I will say we have some really neat and exciting news to share with you guys soon. Um, so you'll have to wait for that. It has to do with uh, our upcoming trip in March. Things are kind of falling into place and I am so excited. More so of just getting away from Nebraska finding some new roads to ride, and most of all, to be with the love of my life and to share it all with you guys. Nothing beats that. drive one of those guys so guys I have something major to discuss with you all I have come to a conclusion <laughs> all on my own that when you own your own bike you want it all <laughs> you want all the accessories that go with it you want everything to make you feel much more comfortable right off the bat at well or as you gradually ride it then you know what you want versus what you don't want especially for me a new rider I had no clue that's why it took me so long to even pick a bike when we were thinking about getting me a bigger bike just because of the tank um, so I could go further. Oh my gosh, it stinks over here. Woo! And it's all them. <laughs> it's all those money makers over there. Um, squirrel, sorry. <laughs> So yeah, um, I want it all, and I want it all like yesterday. <laughs> and I'm sure Stevie will just be laughing as he's editing this because he's always told me every single time we've gotten a different bike together before I was riding by myself, we can get this bike and we don't have to do a thing to it because we won't need to do anything to it because it's already done. Okay. <laughs> fast forward like a year in time 
me thinking, man, I could have so many diamonds for the price of that bike <laughs> just for the accessories that we've installed on it or have had installed on it. <laughs> and now, I, I'm not really asking for diamonds. Not, not that I ever did. I never really asked for diamonds. Jewelry is always nice to give to your wife. Don't get me wrong. But uh, accessories for my bike, <laughs> that's a different story. That's just open up floodgates, guys. <laughs> Especially for me. <laughs> you just want to, you brand it. You want to make it your own. Um, and no bike out there is really looks like the same as the other one because as people buy them, they want to accessorize. They want to change this or that look on it. And that's, that's the fun about it. But back in the day, I always used to just hem and haw over really you really have to have that why can't why can't you just have the bike the way it is scratch that guys that is not a choice you have to or you feel like you need to you don't have to don't get me wrong some people just buy the bike and they don't do anything to it I have yet to meet anybody like that <laughs> but there's nothing wrong with that I just I don't know and it takes me a little bit to get there because at first I didn't want a windshield, but I didn't know what it was like having a windshield versus not. So it's just totally different and new to me. I totally love it. I absolutely love the black on the bottom. Um, and I didn't realize that that's the way it was gonna come. So I'm very, very happy and excited about that because it just makes the, the bike, the look, all that better and different. I do think it looks better without the windshield, but on days like today, wow, totally game changer. I mean, it's, it's what, it's around 62 degrees right now, 63. In Nebraska weather, that's chilly. It's not like shorts weather by any means, but I don't have chaps on. I have my, my high boots on and my jeans on, and I have, let's see, three layers underneath my coat and I don't have my winterized gloves on I should have them on but I didn't grab them but I do have them in my my bag <laughs> so I have it with me as I do my jacket just in case it was warmer than what I thought it was going to be because before I left home I will say <laughs> I honestly had my jacket on and not my coat and then before I left I'm like eh it's December, I should probably just put my coat on, take my jacket with me, just in case I get warm or too warm, which, guys, it's December, it's not gonna happen. <laughs> it could happen, don't get me wrong, but it's, I don't think it's gonna happen. <laughs> oh man, I don't even wanna go home, I just wanna keep riding. If only we had daylight for three more hours already feel the temperature dropping a little bit it's a good day though I love curves they're so much fun I can't wait till March when we're in those curves that we're <laughs> we're headed to We are going to be gone for two weeks, guys. Two weeks. I do believe I'm going to pull over in Ashland and I'm going to get my other gloves out. Because my hands are pretty cold. I do have warm packs with me too. Just in case I was really, really cold. Because I didn't bring any chaps or anything. 